Mets seven and the Yankees five. Here's the second baseman D.J. LeMayhew as we move Leading past the halfway the point in this one and begin Third the bottom baseman, of the fifth. D.J. LeMayhew. First delivery to him on the way. Swing and a liner. A leap, but he can't bring it down. Base hit. Boy, there's another opposite base hit right there, d -Row. It's He's turning a April showers into May Fowlers right now. <laughs> there's no doubt about it. This guy has gotten off to a hot start, but it's his ability to use the whole field. That's what's made the difference. He's not just pull happy or trying to push everything the other way. He's taking what the pitcher's getting. In now, Ed Hedler. As he'll go after the first pitch and promptly line one into left center field, and that's going to get down for a base hit. Now batting, designated hitter, Aaron Hicks. Standing in, Aaron Hicks. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. He's set, here it comes. And a fastball just below the knees, ball one. These are huge innings for a team's morale. The pitcher wants to go out and throw that shutdown inning up and get the boys back swinging the bats again with a chance to capitalize and even extend this current lead. The 1 0 is in off the plate. Well, I know the last thing he wants to do is load the bases right here, so the pressure is on right now to get back in the strike zone. The 2 0 on the way. Outside, 3 0 now. Well, nothing can make you question yourself on that mound more than three straight balls to a guy you know that you should go right after. Sometimes you just lose the strike zone and you don't know why. He's set. Here's the 3 0. Liner toward right center. And he won't get it as that's down for a base hit. And they're content to play station to station here as the bases are loaded now with still nobody out. Nice piece of hitting right there. Looked like the guy on second had to respect it and freeze a little bit. They had to freeze there for a second to make sure that line drive gets through, but eventually does get the third base. Here's Didi Gregorius as he'll take a change up here for strike one. Two hits and two trips for him thus far. A one pitch on its way. And that one just missed outside. That's not a bad pitch right there. That two seamer moving away from a left handed hitter didn't get the strike but I like the idea behind the pitch. Line drive to left. That's in there. Base hit. Notch one in the score column as a runner from third crosses the plate. That makes it seven to six now. Now batting. Third baseman. Edwin Encarnacion. Now the New York manager's up off the bench on his way to the mound. And we're going to have a pitching change as that's going to be all for his starter this afternoon. So the line score will show he departs after just four innings of work and you know they wanted more out of him than this as he won't even stand to be the winning pitcher here. Tim Overstreet is summoned in the toughest situation a reliever can face. Bases loaded, nobody out. Edwin Encarnacion will stand in against the new pitcher and he couldn't ask for a better scenario as he stands in with the bases loaded and nobody out. From the stretch. And now a pitch hit sharply on the ground. Uh, this gets foul. It's 0-1. On its way, the 0-1 pitch. Now a ball pulled hard but fouled off to the left. Here it comes on nothing and two. 
And the changeup is way low that time. Hey, this is a monster strikeout situation right here. A double play would be great in this situation, but I know he's going for the K. You get a one-two count on a guy, he's going to throw his nastiest stuff. Needs a punch out here. Can he get it? Swing, and there it goes. He got all of this one. Gone! It's a grand slam. So he will touch them all on the grand slam. Fourth home run here in the early going as they jump ahead by three. Guys, we've seen four big balls between the two teams so far today. What are your impressions of the long ball display we're watching? Matty D, this is just one of those days where the ball seems to be flying, Dero. The hitters on point, the pitchers aren't making very good pitches. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. It's all about executing pitches, and they're not doing 